The jury has begun deliberating after 17 days of trial. Ex-cop Mark Torrey Jr. is facing murder charges for the 2015 shooting death of fellow officer Bert Piolo. It was about a day and a half of closing arguments, the defense giving its breakdown to the jury, telling them why Torrey Jr. should be acquitted, adding that Torrey was only trying to help a friend. Today, Chief Prosecutor Phil Tidingo giving his rebuttal, saying Tory has the training and experience and knew not to carry a gun when drinking alcohol. He also cited the Guam Police General Order previously shown in court. He also argued against the defense's contention that Piolo was depressed and suicidal, telling the jury it's an outrageous and disrespectful story to put the blame on the victim. Tadinko made a final plea asking the jury to find Tory Jr. guilty of all four charges in the indictment, saying Piolo's death, done reckless, was preventable. Judge Michael Berdello giving his instructions before sending jurors out of the courtroom to begin deliberations. Defense Attorney G. Ariola additionally motioned to sequester the jury, meaning they would have to remain in deliberations until they have a unanimous verdict. Ariola arguing that media coverage of the trial was just too great a risk that could influence the jury's decision. The judge denied the motion. Now we wait the fate of Mark Torrey Jr. What will the jury decide and when? More tonight on Primetime. Stay with KUM.com and check out the KUM News apps for the very latest. From Agatnia for Guam's News Network, I'm McDelgado.